there are some for you. Okay. You're welcome. More, Daddy. More what? More cereal? More toast? More potty. <laughs> more potty? Uh, is that number one or number two? Number seven. Oh, that sounds like a bad one. Uh, skirt, check. Briefcase, check. Kiss, family. Mmm, check. Coffee ready? Uh, no, honey, but I got something hot and brown for you. Oh. <laughs> Robert, I've got constitutional law in 40 minutes. I got her up, I dressed her, I dressed you. Just this once, go get your goggles and radiation suit and dress her yourself. Uh, honey, honey, I I'm making a very complicated breakfast over here. Oh, uh, where? Uh, well, there's a Pop-Tart here, there's some toast here, oh. and I was about to go to the refrigerator to get the jelly. Oh, I apologize. Pushing buttons, tearing cartons, holding cold things. Why don't you go back to bed? I'll postpone my law degree until you get your strength back. <laughs> Please? Let me down. <laughs> okay, I control the remote tonight, and we're watching Enchanted April and the piano. <laughs> Yay, staff, try to cook. I love the smell of home thought breakfast in the morning. Ooh, Dad, an expired milk. You shouldn't have. <laughs> oh, hey, Dad, you know the basketball game's tomorrow, so uh, I assume it's okay if I'm not back until 11? The Peterson males, as you know, are traditionally very trustworthy. Okay, Michael, but you know the rules. Every five minutes you're late, we cut off a finger. Great, can I have it? <laughs> Dad, speaking of tomorrow, there's this concert thing I really want to go to. This guy's a really hot rapper. His album just went platinum. Let me see that. Huh. Ice milk? <laughs> Gang bang thing? <laughs> 98.6? And what's all these asterisks? Blank the police? Dad, yeah, that's just a poetic call for a reevaluation of our penal system set to a tiny hip hop beat. Uh huh. <laughs> Let me hear this young balladeer. <laughs> Booties, booties, big, big booties, 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 big, big, lick my. Oh no, he didn't say what I thought he said. Yes, he did. He just said it again. Now he's spelling it incorrectly. Uh, I I'm sorry, Zaria, you're not going to this concert. You let him go to the basketball game. Dad, you're just treating us differently because Michael's a member of the Mighty Male Fraternity. Well, uh, excuse me. I cannot believe that you are stooping to accuse Dad, our Dad, of sexism. Now, he's a concerned parent, and as a concerned brother, I echo his reservations. So it's not sexism, Zarya. It's loveism. <laughs> okay, that's done. You should hear the filth on this CD. Oh, shouldn't I wait until Nicholas is finished? Booties, booties, big, big booties, booties, big, big booties, booties. Nick, Nicholas, 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 Nicholas. <laughs> that man is saying some bad words that Daddy doesn't want you to hear. Great, which ones are the bad ones? <laughs> I can't tell you that because I'd have to say them myself. Haven't you said it before? Yes, sweetheart, haven't you said them before? Uh, only once when I wanted to see how fast my father was. Now, get over there and eat your breakfast. Somebody's cute little nose is all out of joint. Oh, uh, she's mad because she's not going to this concert. Mom, what do you think? Oh, no, you don't. My opinion is irrelevant. If your father says you're not going, don't try and play him against me, no? Ooh, I'm late. Uh, the babysitter will be here in a second, sweetie. Okay. Mom, Goodbye. Please, Bye. can I go? Be Mom, good. poop the bad word and lick the bad word. <laughs> Boy, women, they are so fragile, yet they can be so recklessly headstrong. <laughs> Michael, I know you're up to something. You don't have any plans for tomorrow night, do you? No. Nope. Oh, okay. <laughs> hey, Mrs. Wilcox. Uh, never mind the pleasantries. Just get me my coffee and a nicotine patch. In fact, give me two so I can dunk one in my coffee. <laughs> Lord only knows why I quit smoking. It's the only pleasurable thing I've done with my mouth uh, since I sucked on that rolled-up Denzel Washington poster. 
Gershaw ran out. You two have an argument? No, no. The answer to all marital troubles is to have lots and lots of sex. <laughs> the trick is to have it with each other. <laughs> It took eight readings of Goodnight Moon and three under-the-bed monster checks, but the smallest Peterson is finally asleep. Then it's time to wake up the biggest Peterson. <laughs> you know, honey, uh, there's something I've been thinking about all day. Me too. No, 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 no. This morning, you said your opinion was irrelevant. You meant redundant, right? Because you agree with me. No, not really. Come here. Come no, here no, 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 no. Get your hands where I can see them. I thought I handled that concert thing pretty well. Robert, I really don't want to talk about this, but if you insist, I think you were wrong. I've been giving this a lot of thought. This thing is being promoted as a concert for teenagers. She doesn't ask for much. We have to start trusting her someday. Why? <laughs> Why? We can't leave her locked in her room forever. Eventually, she'll lose all her day vision and start hanging from the ceiling. <laughs> okay, we have to allow her to make her own mistakes. Our parents let us make ours. I, I, I see that, but you know how hard it is to be a father in the 90s and deal with all the stuff our parents never had to deal with? Drive-by shootings, phone sex numbers, flesh-eating viruses, fat-free cheeses, killer ice skaters. I know you mean well. I'm not crazy about her listening to this stuff, but it is only music. L look at what we listened to when we grew up. Rick James? Mm-hmm. Parliament? Right. Chuck Berry singing Ma Ding-a-Ling. What do you think that was about, the Liberty Bell? Wasn't it? <laughs> Look, we can't protect our children from their music any more than our parents could protect us from ours. I mean, it's like saying to them not to have sex before marriage when we had sex before marriage. You had sex before marriage? Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> there was this really pushy, oversex, smooth talker who told me he was going to be a professor. And then, of course, all his friends. <laughs> okay. Mm. I'll let her go. I guess if our parents could put up with pea funk, mm -hmm. we shouldn't be crying over a little ice milk. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Takes a big man to admit when he's wrong. Now, why don't you get over here and let me show you my good night, Moon? Maybe I don't want to now. Mm. How about now? I want to. I want to. I want to. do if you're alone in a dark alley and three armed lowlifes come at you? Yeah, 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 yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Good. <laughs> sing, sing. Hi-ya, hi-ya, ah! <laughs> Good. <laughs> okay, tomorrow we learn the groin kick. Yeah. Pity we don't have a real lowlife to practice on. Miss Wilcox? Uh, here's one now. <laughs> you looking for an actor? I'm your man. Oh, the only thing you have in common with an actor is people applaud when you leave a room. <laughs> oh, come on. I do bad guys. And I do good guys. 
face, and I do romantic leads. Oh. What? Do you do short order cooks? I'm about to scramble your eggs. <laughs> Mrs. Wilcox, I'm only paying you to babysit two kids. Derek, let's go play some ball, man. Mrs. Wilcox, is poop a bad word? Oh, not at my age, honey. It's more like having a welcome weekend guest. Come on, let's go. And as for you, I got a rat trap in my purse. <laughs> Man, that's a hard woman. Hey, Dad, I heard you changed your mind and let Zaria go. Gutsy call. You know, you're the father. I just know if she were my sweet little daughter, I'd build a fortress of love around her to keep her from harm. But maybe I care too much. Well, I'm outie. <laughs> Wow, what a polite, well-spoken young man. What is he up to? I don't know. And what did you change your mind on? Oh, I told Zaria she couldn't go to some concert, and uh, now she's going to some new rapper, Ice Milk. Are you crazy? You know why he calls himself fat? No. He shot two guys over a carton of low fat. <laughs> why don't you just send her to a pit of wild dogs wearing poke chop earrings? <laughs> you got to follow Zaria and bring her back. I can't do that. I told her this morning I trusted her. I can't change my mind again. You didn't change it the first time. Jerry changed it for you. Were you in bed at the time? <laughs> mm -hmm. Then it doesn't count. <laughs> Robert, you were not in your right mind. <laughs> That's right. You got to follow Zaria, and you got to bring her back. You know, they say sometimes in that booty song, you know, milk points to a honey in the crowd, and the roadies toss her on stage. Some of them are never seen again. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. I wonder whatever happened to our sweet little Zaria. <laughs> you under that awful urban accent? You're with child. <laughs> You're with a lot of childs. Yo, sorry I ain't written a call, but I've been stupid crazy. What with Milk's new album and arraignments and all, and me dropping three babies in two years? MC1, MC2, and Scratch. <laughs> whoa, whoa, here comes number four. Somebody grab it. I should have just let you intervene. I should have never let her go to that concert. Paul! Breathe, baby, breathe. Paul, Robert, Paul. <laughs> breathe, baby, breathe. <laughs> You're right. I, I, I gotta follow her. Yeah, and I got the perfect disguise. She won't even know we're there. <laughs> Make sure your pants are sagging. Cool, 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 cool. The more they sag, the tougher you are. You show weakness. These cats will cut our feet off and make us kick our own ass. <laughs> roll, roll. <laughs> what up, dog? <laughs> that was all right. You look fierce. ZZ, look at those two old farts trying to be cool. <laughs> They just go home and listen to their Rufus albums. That's what I'm saying. I hope if I try to dress like that when I'm their age, somebody shoots me. Oh my God! We're blending in. We're blending in. We're blending? Are you kidding? Yo, Lo, you strapped? Yeah, I'm strapped. I'm, I'm super strapped. Look like we gonna go round and round then. Whatever, poodle. <laughs> 
nuts? You just told him that you carrying a gun. I, what? Yes, and I just noticed something else. We're the only ones wearing green. I think we just committed a real big fashion don't. You brought me to a rap concert wearing the wrong gang colors. You know, you never mention the good thing that I do. Yeah. I'm not leaving out of here without Zaria, and especially with all this cursing and swearing going on. And bleeding. You shut up, your mouth. the sign of peace. Either that, or you just told him to live long and prosper. <laughs> Bring him here. Oh. Oh. Peace, man. What they call you? Uh, Professor uh, R.P. <laughs> Who's that fool? Oh, this this is my, my DJ, MCI. He used to be AT&T, but he switched. <laughs> So what say, uh, you, him, and me, and the homies go toss up some phonies? Those are these really big beers. Uh, actually, we love to have a drink, but we can't because we got... Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Y'all got it going on and everything, but we got to drive by on 95th and a half hour. And you know the traffic. Oh, yeah. Plus, we get to drinking it all, we hardly be able to hit nobody. <laughs> L.M. Check this out. You pop a top, I'll bust a cat. That means shoot us. Uh, we love to have a drink, you know what I mean? Pop, pop the top, you know what I mean? But, but first, why don't y'all drive ahead? We, we'll follow you in the Volvo, you know what I'm saying? Because uh, we got the baby seats in the back. And so, if you had anything smaller than those 40s, like the 20s, I know Michael! Morning! You were out late. Yeah, I know. You were out late? Uh, yeah, I had a beer with some friends. <sighs> Did Zarya get home okay? Uh-huh. Oh, my Lord. Oh, there was nearly a riot at that concert last night. No, the one Zaria went to against my better judgment? <laughs> oh, Robert, you were right. I feel terrible. I, I, I was right, and, and you should feel terrible, but let's put your horrible mistake behind us. Good morning, Karen. Honey, are you all right? We saw the paper. Oh, I'm fine. Oh. Hey, Dad. <laughs> There was almost a fight between this gang and two of the oldest, ugliest rappers you ever saw. You should have run out of there. Oh, I ran all right. Straight to the one-hour film place to have these photos of the concert developed. Wanna see? Oh, sure, sweetheart. Don't waste your mother's eyes on these horrific photos. <laughs> Michael. Hey, Dad. Did you have fun last night? Oh, yeah, the game was real tight, real tight. Yeah, real squeaker, 107 to 40. Did you enjoy the concert? Concert? Father, whatever do you mean? I didn't go to any concert. You were already grounded one week. You want to try for two? Oh, that concert. <laughs> he was at the concert, too? Mm-hmm. Robert, I, I just should have let you handle the whole thing. Well, yes. Oh, but, Dad, how is it that you knew that that's where I went? Yeah, Dad. He could have been, oh, a hundred places he wasn't supposed to be. Well, Let's he... see those pictures. <laughs> Whoa! That big butch fly girl was you? <laughs> you started the riot? It was a tiny riot. And you sat here and let me fall all over myself apologizing. <laughs> they need some quality time. I think so. <laughs> Honey, I know you're mad at me, but I have two very good things to say in my defense. One of them better not be. It was all Derek's idea. Okay, I have one very good thing to say in my defense. I'm listening. They're my children, and I love them. 
I, I know I was wrong and I know I was stupid, but when it comes to their safety, I can't think straight. And as mad as you are at me right now, I'd probably do it again. Robert, I seem to remember having this vague association with those children. Oh, yes, I'm their mother. <laughs> and since we made them together, let's raise them together, okay? And the next time you come up with a plan and you don't want to tell me about it, it's probably because it's stupid. <laughs> but it was very sweet. So I'm forgiven. Sure, it's over and forgotten. <laughs> Nobody will even remember. Saw you dancing on stage last night. I shocked you myself. <laughs> So you got a Macintosh, too? CD-ROM? This is a nice vibe. Lalique? <laughs> you know... Dad! What is it, Nicholas? It's Hoochie Mama, a bad word. Yeah, little man. That term is very disrespectful to women, and I don't think you should be using that type language in your father's house. 